Ugh. So dizzy. Good morning. Are you dizzy? He's just been spinning around all the time. <laughs> He's like, I got bored. I was playing freaking Wii Tennis. <laughs> uh, looks like you remembered something. This one looked like... <laughs> this one looked like more love advice, just like the day before yesterday. The last person was Shin, but today was... Who? I've never heard that voice. Oh, you got it. It was beautiful. <laughs> Still, you've been recovering a lot of memories lately. It would be a problem if you fully recovered right now. I wouldn't be able to talk to you anymore. But you can still see me clearly, right? That could mean you still haven't reclaimed the most important memory or feeling just yet. He goes, all oh, right, I hate him. <laughs> oh, you were awake! You seem so disoriented in the mornings. Were you always this bad at waking up? No, you drugged her <laughs> continuously for a few days. It's probably a side effect of all the drugs that you gave her. <laughs> You're like a different person from last night. <laughs> what, in that she's actually talking? Or right here. Are you getting something from her body language? <laughs> oh, right. Here. I've got you a wheel to run in. What's this box? <laughs> What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> <laughs> what a like ledge! Thousand pieces. You're all right. It's all baked beans. <laughs> it's a Smarties oh. puzzle. It'll take oh, you the rest of your life. I heard there's a different price for if you're getting like the neutral. It's a plain white <laughs> dude. Like the best one. It's a Game Boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's already played games with her though. Yeah, but. What? Like the TV so even, far away. Like it can even fit like a, a one thousand piece jigsaw puzzle on this on the base of this cage. <laughs> just piece by piece, or you just unload it on top of it. And what is the graphic of this puzzle? Don't know. It's not explained that. <laughs> Ryan's gonna be so annoying. Like that piece goes there. <laughs> that piece goes there. I can't help, but that piece goes there. It's like I, I am amazing at jigsaws and you are ruining it. <laughs> ah, how annoying. Is this just how he is, or is he trying to be irritating? If he's always like this, I'm sure he has lots of enemies. Well, <laughs> that's probably wrong. Toma, can su <laughs> Toma conducts himself better than this, but something about his character. Maybe he doesn't realise yeah. that he is just irritating, and he's seriously trying to help you relieve your boredom. <laughs> I can't tell if he's nice or if he's not. He's locked he us in a just... cage, so I'm assuming not. <laughs> he needs to just give her a JRPG or an MMO, and then she won't even know she's in a cage. That's true. I should be so lost in that one. <laughs> I'll be out for a little while. I'm just go and drop by your place. I'll just borrow your key for a bit. What? Wait, what should you do? Don't worry. I'm just going to go clean the mailbox and tear down the posters. Why? <laughs> I haven't been in there for a while, so I'm sure there's stuff to clean up. What posters? Like one, like missing posters for this girl that's <laughs> been kidnapped. <laughs> um, like the girls who are harassing her are putting posters on her door. I think. <laughs> this lady is not very nice. Posters. Yeah, pretty much. I think that's that's what's implied. We think that Icky likes her, and therefore we don't like her. <coughs> yeah. Huh? More detailed in the book below. You went home the other day, right? I left your computer battery out by accident, so I'm sure you saw the messages. Turns out everyone hates you. <gasps> what else did you see? The posters? Your mailbox filled with ketchup. <laughs> All right, caught ketchup. <laughs> I clean everything up, but you figured it out, right? Or did you not? You've been doing that? Whoa, whoa, don't pretend like you didn't notice. I was pretty obvious. <laughs> oh, wait, did you seriously not realise that I was cleaning all that stuff up? You know, I think that's kind of a problem. How slow can you be? 
Wow. Well, I don't even like you anymore. Get out of my cage. You know, <laughs> <laughs> this is exactly why I get so overprotective of you. You're a fucking moron. You overprotective? Don't realize when you're being bullied. Overprotective? I think this is way beyond <laughs> that level. You didn't think I knew you went back home, did you? Sorry. Well, I've got a sharp senses. That's why I'm so good at poker. Hit me. <laughs> <laughs> He's just standing there and someone hands him a card. Uh, oh, just so you know, I didn't put a tracker on you or anything. That's <laughs> I don't intend to infringe upon your privacy that much. Just yeah. your human rights. <laughs> oh, God. I would take the tracker if it meant we could get out of this cage. Anyway, I don't mind if you hide things from me, but assume that I know them already. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. She accidentally breaks one of the jigsaw pieces and says, hides, no, Toma knows, Toma knows. <laughs> go I'm sure you already know this, but it's pretty hard to fool me. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. He's going to go on Pen and Teller now. He's going to do his tricks. Pen and Teller. Toma realised everything and just pretended not to know. I don't like this. It's Isn't. really creepy to think a guy like that has you confined. He's just too perfect! And he's got sharp <laughs> senses, there's no way to escape. And Orion's definition of perfection. <laughs> <laughs> and what kind of relationship did you have with Toma before anyway? I can't even imagine how you even developed a friendship with a guy like that. <laughs> <laughs> I think that one well, has good points. Well, it has maybe. to be the top one because we don't know what he was like before. Like what? He's got a fine to... booty. <laughs> Are you not able to Look answer that, that because your memories haven't come back? Or can you just not think of anything? Uh, I think it's the latter. I reckon these two should be on Jeremy Kyle, you know? <laughs> <laughs> My. Childhood friend locked me in a cage. Lie detector results. <laughs> Shows that you are not. He is, in ah. fact, your dad. Um. <laughs> <laughs> well, that makes sense because he faked being a family member before. Their family tree has one branch. <laughs> ah, I'm tired. Stay sure with a lot of work. I think the landlord will get mad. Because there's tomato sauce seeping through all these mail. <laughs> I'm back, Pat the Bee. <laughs> it would be nice if you welcomed me home. <laughs> Your oh, Katie! <laughs> <laughs> Although that might be asking a little too much. There were so many posters, but I tore them all down. I cleaned the mailbox too. Barbecue sauce today. They must be running out. <gasps> they really oh. like to use things like mayonnaise and ketchup. Egg they sauce. keep it fresh with variety. <clears throat> She's like being attacked by hot dog makers. <laughs> That'll be mustard. Yeah. <laughs> energy what this? It's your energy feel. <laughs> Soaked in all of oil. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> it's a that's good that, source that's, of that's sustenance. Delicacy. <laughs> the landlord said he knows he can't help it since they're all just you'll bad have to leave. But at this rate, you'll have to leave. Why is no one calling the police? This is actually vandalism. Why is no one calling police? There, there are no police. <laughs> Clearly. If they were police, then people would be <laughs> able to get away with locking their childhood Homer friends in cages. <laughs> in this timeline, Homer would be in prison, as would a lot of other characters in the <laughs> series. This is troublesome. Ugh, my hands are all sticky. <laughs> it's got nothing to do with the olive like, oil. I mean, and even and if there was like actual police, there's certainly no fashion police <laughs> because Kent would not be allowed outside. Okay. Ever, actually. Ever. Oh, it might be good for the skin. I'm going to go look that up on the computer. You know, I don't really like Toma. <laughs> but it's nice that he's cleaning up for you. Oh, my God. 
Cleaning and up he takes such like... good care of the skin. <laughs> Cleaning up things like rotten eggs and dead bugs sounds like really dirty work. But I still can't forgive him. <laughs> <clears throat> <clears throat> I finally got it off. The smell is still there, though. But it's all so it's not too bad. Olive oil costs. Yeah, it's expensive. Yeah, I know, man. This smell is a lot better than the black vinegar from the other day. Mm -hmm. Why you look? What are you? Why are you looking <laughs> over here? <laughs> is there something you want to tell me? I'll be happy if it's not a complaint <laughs> or an objection. You're, you, you, you can say anything you want to be. Thank you, Thomas. Yeah, let's <laughs> thank him. <laughs> dot dot dot. <laughs> oh, it's not a problem. Yeah. The book said that Stockholm doesn't start for three days. <laughs> Shouldn't thank someone who's keeping you captive. Wow, at least he knows. I didn't think I'd ever be able to hear words like thank you from your lips again. Do it again. <laughs> you <laughs> really are an idiot. I always have to go. That smile is bearing as you're saying it as well. I don't like Toma. No? <laughs> no. He's such a chump, though. He's he's so nice. It's Icky. Oh yeah. I never thought uh, I'd be excited like... to see Icky because his hair is so bad. Like... His hair's fine. It's his everything. His hair else. is horrible. <laughs> All right. Oh, we're at the gates. Someone you like? Huh? Oh, so you've grown up enough to say things like that. Well, you are in college already. Pretty late to start getting interested in men, if you ask me. Your window's gone. You can never <laughs> you're, you're damaged goods, love. Love me. <laughs> you just entered college. You're already talking about this. Should you find a guy you like at university? Hmm, shocked. Why should I be? This is something I should be happy about. He's talking to himself now. Because even you are finally starting to act like a normal girl. Just like me. How many days are there again? 30. What is it? 30, okay. Got a joke. Who is Toma's favourite actor? Nicolas Cage. Yeah. <laughs> What's what's um, Thomas' favorite chicken dish? Cajun chicken. Yeah. <laughs> I've been waiting weeks. <laughs> <laughs> Morning. You remembered something. Are you okay? Can you still see me? It seems like you can. That's good. It's actually a bad thing that a human can see me, but this is an emergency situation. Still, you've been remembering a lot of things that. lately. Yeah, you can still see me. Hmm. Something must be missing. You know, all these things you've been remembering lately seem to be love advice. I guess we can assume that those are the most important memories. <laughs> and if that's the case, I think the only thing is missing is the memory of who you actually liked. Not a single memory you've reclaimed up until now has shown the face or even the voice of the person you liked, unfortunately. I think it was Toma, though. <laughs> Back when we believed Tomo was your boyfriend, I thought it was weird that you had no memories of the time you were a couple. Looking back now, that's obvious. He wasn't your boyfriend. <sighs> Setting that aside, I think it's a major issue that you can't remember who you liked. Who could it have been? Could it have been the guy we suspected? That icky guy? He's icky. <laughs> icky is icky. He's I know we put- Finger licky good. <laughs> I know we put off recovering your memories due to these circumstances, but I think we need to think about that too. Still, it seems like you were even going to Toma for love advice, and that might have been one of the triggers that caused him to snap. Speaking of Toma, do you see him laying down over there? His stupid face. Look how cute he is. He's such a bishy. Fall for him. <clears throat> Did you know? Every day, Every day after putting you in this cage, he slept on the floor. He seemed to be up late yesterday writing a report, so he's fast asleep for a change. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Is he waking up because we were talking about him? 
There's no we in that. Mm -hmm. do, do you, does he not own jammies? You don't sleep in that. He's got studs on him. He'll hurt his, he'll hurt his little arm. Do we care? He's punishing himself because he feels bad about the, the cage. The whole situation. What a weird dream. Huh? Wait. What? A dream? Am I awake? I dreamt of like a dream. Can I kill myself and come back to life? <laughs> Why are you, are you my What? House? No, no. Are you fucking you joking? Okay. Oh, is this going to be multiple personalities? <laughs> oh, fuck off. We'd like to ask that <laughs> ourselves. Huh? Wait, this is strange. What? What would you the cage? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ah, oh, that's right. Oh, I did this. Oh, early morning <laughs> amnesia. It's like this game. <laughs> it's almost like I've got amnesia. Cut to credits. <laughs> but uh, uh, it kind turns of out that he's had amnesia. <laughs> I guess Tom is half asleep still. I almost thought I was going to die. Seeing you like this without remembering anything beforehand is pretty shocking. If I'm not prepared, the shock might actually give me a heart attack. <gasps> Man, that was startling. When I look at this with a level head, I wonder what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> but that doesn't mean I can stop. I just can't stop. <laughs> Looks like you were the one to make up first. Wake up to <laughs> Looks like you were the one to wake up first today. I must have overslept a bit. Good morning, Patlin B. Why do you sleep on the floor? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're sleeping on the floor too. You should just put the cage on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> I can't sleep in a bed when you're sleeping on the floor because of me. Well, this way, it's fair. I said I'd buy you a mat, but I still haven't done that. Keep on forgetting that you're in a cage. It's pretty hard to find one in a size that'll fit in there. I've been looking pretty hard. It's pretty hard to use my blacksmith in background to make a mat. <laughs> he goes to try and he just makes this metal grate. <laughs> so not again. <laughs> Damn it. He might do I bizarre... made you a bed of steel wool. <laughs> he might do bizarre things, but he's also trying to treat you kindly, I think. You should say thank you again. Why is this <laughs> game in any way trying to convince us that Toma is anything but a complete fuckhead? I want to see him. I really want to see him. But I can't yet. The me right now is still... Blind. Just a little more. Just a little bit longer. I should... It's just a little longer until I can tell him these feelings. Man, you know, it'd be original, right? If in one of these worlds she didn't like any of them. <laughs> and she was just a strong, independent woman. And it's just like, she didn't need no which... shit from no man. Yeah, like, she, it, it's Spoilers, just like, we didn't know. That's two of the roots. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Well, good. You'd have to play the game good. to find out. I don't really I want to. I bought the game from Steam during the sale, so yeah. <gasps> Sorry, looks like I woke you up. I was watching you sleep. Are you mad? Just fucking punch him. I, I've already given up, and I know I'm past the point of no return. But I really am scared of being hated by you or Shin. I wanted you to be happy, you and Shin. You're both like family, and I treasure you. You're beautiful. <laughs> but I really am the worst. Yeah, I am. She didn't find out about this. <laughs> I doubt I'd get away with just a punch in the face. You'd lock me in a cage. <laughs> That's what we do to solve our problems. What would I do after Shin beats the hell out of me? What then? Go back to my blacksmithing background. 
start up a shop the next prefecture over. <gasps> Maybe I'd move somewhere far away so you'd never see me again. Cage Labs now hiring. <laughs> <clears throat> He'll work in a prison, making bars. <laughs> Just every time, it's like, oh, yeah. He turns to a prisoner, you're beautiful. <laughs> you remind me of a girl I used to know. <laughs> anyway, I'll be out for a while. I'll be borrowing your key again. I don't think it'll take too long, but behave yourself. He says to behave yourself, but there's not much you can do. Oh, you could seriously. shout really now, fell out <laughs> fuck with the puzzle pieces. What could we possibly do to improve your situation? If we wait, if we wait around too long, there could be a limit to the memories you can recover. <clears throat> one hour later. Yeah, one hour later. <sighs> I'm so bored. Fucking why? Why did you don't have any right to complain? Want to do As a jigsaw well, these... puzzle? It'd probably be even more frustrating. Uh, and there's nothing to lean on. Pat Labita that... turn around and just go, "Fuck off, Orion!" <laughs> Orion's <laughs> such a twat. No, he got Ryan us in this. No, he got us in this situation, and now he he's the one who's been complaining the whole time for his sake. Trust Toba, love Toba. He's a great guy. Oh, ah, oh, now we're in a cage. It's okay, Orion. Cage. I still love you. <laughs> and there's nothing to lean on in that cage beside iron bars. Wanna we'll ask for a chair? <laughs> Whoa! Does he take requests? Is there an earthquake? Hey, look over there. The bar moved there when you were just leaning against it. That means. Hey, try pushing it Shoddy up towards the top of the cage. <laughs> it came he... off. You can do it. Just a little more. He made that for us, though. That's well me. He's gonna want his words. <laughs> oh shit, son! The cat's out of the bag. I, I can't believe it. You were able to get out. All we had to like do was lean against that. Five days early would have been great. Mm. Has, he, has he got the warranty? <laughs> yeah, that's what I was wondering. Because that's proper bollocks. Like a dog, a large dog, like a Great Dane, is so much stronger than a tiny little yeah. woman. That's a terrible design. But more the child. Like, I don't know what brand this is, but I think the game should tell us what brand it is so we could avoid it in the future. <laughs> Because Great Danes are expensive dogs, man. You would not want one of them escaping, especially if, in, if it's in like a severe situation. But actually, no, sorry. We established that this cage was made by Toma because he's a blacksmith, so he's probably just sort of a trainee blacksmith. Like, um, um, he's got an, an apprenticeship. Finish my apprenticeship. Yeah, he's got an apprenticeship. The University of Blacksmiths. And so he's sort of bodged it a little bit. Thinks it's all right. Like he's like he knows a uh, like his smith master. Is told him it's not quite ready for a Great Dane, <laughs> but he's like, okay, she's she's weaker than a Great Dane, um, and so we thought it'd be okay, but not quite. All right, I'm I'm, I'm, I'm down with it. You cannot uh, rush your skills. <laughs> looks <laughs> like the, <laughs> looks like the cage is defective. The bottom of the barn must not have been welded properly. Uh, what should we do? Is Want it... to escape? But you can't go back to your place. We still don't know the person behind all the harassment. But still, it's dangerous just to stay in this room. Uh, uh, we don't have time to hesitate. Tom is back! Get just back grab your cell game. phone at least so you can call for help any time. Your phone's on the shelf. Hurry and hide it in the puzzle box. Da -da -da -da. Done? Is everything done? Okay? Yes? What's gonna happen now? It's gonna be. <laughs> you made it. That puzzle making noises. On oh, back. Oh. The mailbox was stringy jelly. Weird stringy jelly. Nice. Okay. It was actually pretty easy to clean up. So that's good. Why would they choose that of all things? The lineup has been for food for a while now. Maybe the culprit's running out of ideas. If he just stopped to keep cleaning it, fresh. it, they would stop adding to it, surely. Yeah. Just fill it with, like, paper or something. No one's leave it there. Anyway, the data. Well, I'll do that later. 
I'll just take it off the shelf for... Huh? What is your phone, Patlin B? <laughs> <coughs> hmm, it's not here. Did he notice your cell phone's gone? That's strange. I could have sworn I put it in here. Maybe it fell somewhere. Da, ah, turn the phone off quickly while Thomas not looking over there. Maybe I'll try calling it. I'm sure I'll hear it even if it's on silent. Wow. I'm a robot. I react to waves. Mm hmm. This number be maybe in an area out of service or it may be turned off. Patlin B escaped! Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> oh right. I haven't changed it in forever. The battery probably died. Speaking of things dying, <laughs> Patlin B, I'm sorry. I seem to have misplaced your cell phone. <laughs> She's like, what? That's very important to me. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in this room, but you haven't gotten out of there, right? Because Master Blacksmith said I still needed to work on it. Top one. How good I? Ooh. Yeah, I'd go. <laughs> oh, I can't do that. I want to, but I can't. Okay, that didn't seem to do anything. <laughs> These parameters just sort of do their own thing. They might. I think there's set times when they change, like every five or ten or something. But that's right, there's no way it could have gotten out of that cage. I must have misplaced it. I'll look for it later. Could it even be behind the shelf? Sigh. The, that was close. We managed to get through that. This is the first time we fooled Toma. I'm just sweating cold bullets and I can't even sweat. But now See? we know that you can escape this cage and you can contact someone since you have your phone. <coughs> the right, only thing left Ryan is finding the right timing plans. to get out of here and recovering your memories before it's too late. Surely, literally, Easy. all you need to do right now is text Shin and say, I am in a cage. Help. <laughs> That sound. Oh, that's me. Huh. Oh, wait. What's that that's sound? you, sir. <laughs> Mr. Poldy's coming. Woo! <laughs> woo! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> woo! Stand back a bit. Hurry up! <laughs> okay. Oh, that's what is all this? Oh, all this! Oh, man. It's a bit full in there now. Looks like there was a quite a bit. <laughs> now Ryan's going to be like, he's so nice, you should marry him. <laughs> I said, what is all this? I'm sure you're bored in there, so I gathered some stuff you might like. I don't really know your interests lately, so most of it's stuff that you liked as a kid. <laughs> where's where's, where's her N64? <laughs> There are stuffed toys and books and boxes of chocolates and dolls. I thought it might be a bit less dreary in there. Or is this just annoying to you? I'll take it out. <laughs> you changed your mind pretty quick. You didn't oh. even try the jigsaw puzzle. Oh, it seems oh. like you didn't like anything I gave you. Got the jigsaw puzzle. I give up. Is this Toma showing affection or is this just guilt? It's probably Pretty both. certain it's guilt. But it looks like a toy box. You're like one of Toma's toys. That's probably right. This room is like a toy box and a treasure box to Toma. He's stowing away the things that are important to him. Like bunny rabbits and dolls. <laughs> yeah. Gonna wake up and Tom is having a tea party with Shin in a dress tomorrow. <gasps> hmm, what is it? Oh man, if, if if we choose the, if we choose the top one, right? Then he might do a figure spotlight on us. <laughs> <laughs> you did this to make me happy, right? 
Alright. Okay, make him angry. Sure. Make him angry. I don't want to make Hope him angry because we're already locked in a cage. You could stab us he's, pretty he, easily. He, he's not going to stab us. The whole point we're in a cage is to keep us safe. <laughs> like shooting fish in a cage. He's not going to kill us. I don't know. He could snap at any point like he did before. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you in a cage again? Oh, you're right, mate. <gasps> Pretty much. But you aren't happy, are you? You've got a problem with something. <laughs> I'm sure you want me to let you out. Not gather toys for you. And so he's, he's a detective. Your chocolate. <laughs> I'm sorry. Go on, man, go on, man. It really won't be much longer. I'll have the evidence I need in just a little while. I'm gonna solve this case, baby. Detective Tomer on the case. 